Hello guys, I am Rubab and I'm back with another Knights and Dragons video. So today the um, three day war will end and as you can see we are fighting with Divergent Freaks and um, it is the last war and we are aiming for top 25, we are on place 60 now and on place 1 we got Armor Killers, EMP Guild I think with almost 100 million points and Bond Beyond Time with 81 million points on top 2 Beastmall Gods on top 3 and there are the other top 25 goals to top 50 goals as you can see and um, yeah it isn't a um, um, cheap war because you can um, win a 6 star armor here as you can see I have to time it and um, yeah it is just insane um, you have 3001 defense and 2913 um, attack stats on the plus version and on the regular version a little bit lower so yeah on top 25 we can win chaos venger plus and top top 50 the regular version of the chaos venger to top 750 you can win the demon scarabase which is legendary and um, yeah it's pretty insane so what we will do now is to combine some epics but before that we will um, attack at least four times the stripped guildmaster he has a druidic so a tip to the um, newer guys who don't play the, this game so long um, if you attack a strip guy strip means um, in this game in this game like um, he's wearing one armor which can be easily take uh, taken out um, or whatever it's called and yeah um, you just have to um, take three armors one which can take uh, the armor of the opponent down quickly and the rest should be um, weak uh, weaker armors like nemesis two stars one stars whatever um, yeah, I'm using Nemesis because I like the look of them and you can also put put in um, fusion boost armors or so, but yeah. If you do that you will get 760 points from the Guildmaster and that's um, extremely high. So now we will um, do the epic combine with strong armors, the regular Chaos Vengeance which is my third or fourth Chaos and I will combine it with my runic robes. So I'm hoping for um, Ashen Fire of a Ravage robes, not um, Ravage Shield Mail again. Um, I already got it once, but yeah, it doesn't mind if I. Well, what is this? Oh, it's the Flame God. The Flame God Plate Mill, it's almost so strong as my Chaos Venger, and yeah, I like it. It isn't too outdated, in my opinion. And yeah, I will max it directly, so see you guys in one or two minutes. So here we go, we just maxed out the Flame God Plate Mail, it is on level 99 now with um, okay stats, it isn't too bad, it isn't that great now, but yeah, it is a mono fire epic so it's actually okay, um, not too bad. Um, I will use it of course in raids because I fuse so many fire epics and other epics away that I don't have any left and yeah so the stats aren't that bad and yeah so I will go back to the fight and yeah 
I will come back if we um, are finished and yeah, see you then. So here we are with the top 25 roar. We just ended and um, yeah, here it is, the rewards, Chaos Ranger plus 10 fusion boost spirit armors, 10 of the Dark Prince case and 30 gems. We got it to rank 18 here and um, yeah we have 9.5 million points and yeah we really did a lot of strip wars so um, I didn't have to use so many gems for it. Actually I don't have to use any of them but I just did it to secure um, our top 25 um, spot and of course with my gold mats as well and here it is the top 25 list and again the rewards I got my second Chaos Venger plus which is pretty cool because I have now three epics plus the duo play plus and two Chaos plus and um, I can't directly max my Chaos plus now because I um, just um, just uh, max my flame god there from the combined so I will almost or even try to almost max my cows my second cows plus and here yeah, armor killers did a great job here with almost 100 million points bond beyond time on place 2 beast mod gods on place 3 sylden sylden elfus or whatever it called on place 4 and yeah it's actually a quite a big gap from top 1 to top 3 and yeah Qmob just kicked out from top 10 with almost 2 million points so that was a huge gap there and yeah so it was quite a cool world Latinos del Mundo which means in Spain Spain something with world Latinos of the world or so I don't know and yeah so Death Knight Slayers and Sarkozy just kicked out from top 50 so sorry for you guys that you don't even got the regular version but it isn't too bad you have the chance to get it next time or so and here are our top players so 500k to 300k and so it, it is quite impressive how much they jammed for, um, for secure the top 25 um, spot and here we go I have 109k points and lost 12 times and yeah it isn't too bad and I started the war with just 20 gems and farmed while you were I think 150 or 160 gems or so with um, Tapture which is an impressive app you just have to download it and watch videos for like three or four gems or have to download the app for 15 gems or so and we just opened 10 of the Dark Princess and just got shit here one Risa amulet or ring no it was an amulet but it sucked and um, yeah I will try to max my cows my second cows Venger plus here so see you guys So we have it on level 61 or 62 and yeah I already have the maxed Chaos Venger Plus here and the level 61 Chaos Plus here and 
Well, the stats aren't too bad for a mono epic, but um, yeah, I can enhance it a little bit more. Um, well, I have 16 million gold, so I could um, donate like 14 million gold to my guild to get some uh, fusion boost, fusion boost armors. And here we go, 40 million gold. Clicking on contribute and getting the fusion boost armors. So we are getting fire, earth, air, earth, water, and air and spirit fusion boost armors. So quite a few, but of course you want max it directly. Um, I think I will need three or four days at least, and um, yeah. We got it to rank 72 and yeah, it was it for today and thank you for watching my video and don't forget to rate, subscribe and comment and have a nice day, peace out.